then we have a real problem. But the investigative if, structure yeah. for that but, is still ongoing. That does not change it, because Jim Comey is not leading it. And in fact, you know, when all of this dies down, he may be very glad to not have to deal with any of that anymore, at least for a while. Uh, Mark, one last thought, and then I want to get back to Judge Napolitano quickly. Sure. No, I mean, the question is, I mean, how does Trump benefit from this? If anything, it's much harder for him. Number one, Good he's point. going to have to go and find somebody to take this job. Who the heck wants this portfolio? It's going to be very hard to find somebody to take on the to take on this task. Two, he's got to get them confirmed. Can you you just saw Chuck Schumer's press conference? Can you imagine the field day Democrats are going to have with this with this uh, confirmation hearing and how they're going to use this as a platform for all these political charges against Trump? Yeah. So there's no upside to this for Donald Trump, except that the, the and, and on top of that, he's going to have to, you know, he, they're going to be using this for attacks on him and questioning his integrity. Uh, so he's and he's got a he's got a lot of big things to do. He's got to get health care reform through. He's got to get tax reform through. This is a huge distraction and chaos thrown into the mix. Difficult.